boy Sims, I'm Stevie John and welcome back to Firewatch. I've been so excited to come back to this game. It was a really awesome game. Um, and the story that I, line that, that caught my attention the last time, it was so fucking awesome. So I'm not even going to waste any time. I'm getting right into this because I really want to play this game. I've been looking forward for it for too long. But I don't want to spam out all the videos to keep on with one game. Then you guys might get bored and I might get bored and then we'll never get to the end of it. And I see I've, I've, some, of, some of you guys have tuned me cuck so far that I haven't been finishing up the things that I started. And there's quite a few of them that I really wanted to finish up by... The, by I wanted to finish them in any case, but then every time something falls... What the fuck? Oh yeah, this is where we were last time. Okay, let's drop down here. Woo! Dude, your fucking legs. You will break your fucking legs, dude. But in any case, so what I wanted to do was I wanted to get... Uh, I wanted to finish up all the games um, that I haven't finished so far. Like, for instance, things that you guys really enjoyed. Like, uh, the what, what was it called? Um, the one you're taking over the world, Plague Incorporated. I really loved that game and it seemed like you guys liked it as well. So I think I might come back and just finish those games up as well, because um, I don't want to. I don't want to leave games half finished on it. it I kind of feel uncomfortable with that, and I have no fucking idea where to go to. Dude, do we still have a flashlight though? Yeah, we still got a flashlight. Okay. All right, I think I. Oh, I thought I had to go back, but apparently that's not the thing, because I went back very very far and now I'm coming back so it looks like we're climbing up this fucking mountain now um and it's getting kind of scary out here yeah? I hope there's no wildlife wild animals shit trying to kill my face here yeah? I hope there's only one way on this game because I can't find another way somewhere else so we'll just hope for the fucking best then but this game really looks fucking good though and I love the fact that he still wears his his, his wedding ring that's awesome Makes like he says, uh, I can't even remember what her name was. Julia, Julia. He, still, he still loves Julia. But now, what trail closed? Oh, fuck. Dude. Oh, fuck me. Fuck me. Okay, damn it. Is this our watchtower? I hope so. Look, kind of looks like it. So I weren't so far from my... Can we use the toilet? Hey, we got a ba baseball. Pee wherever I want as well. Haha, <laughs> you awesome. <laughs> she said she pisses everywhere. Anyway, she wants. That's great. Fucking see a tree? Just wax it all over the tree face. What the fuck happened now? Why is the music playing? Okay, I don't know. I don't like it when music starts playing because that usually means bad shit are gonna happen and I don't know what type of game this is yet. I don't know if there's scary shit that's actually going to happen. Oh, fuck me. Okay, but that's probably their teenagers. Told you bad shit was gonna happen. Just had that feeling in my ass. Just close my door. Can I close my door? No, I can't. My jacket. Someone broke in. They what? They just, they wrecked the place. Threw my typewriter out the window. Motherfucker. That sounds very nice. Holy shit. Um, I'll let the Forest Service know what happened. <laughs> okay, well. These fuckers broke my fucking... My sheets are stolen. My fucking sheets are gone. They stole your sheets? That's just mean. Yeah, it sucks. 
Okay, I put in a call. Uh, thanks. That was forced. What can they do? Well, what can they do about it? W will they catch whoever did it? This is the Forest Service, Henry. They're not exactly Hawaii Five-0. <laughs> do you have any idea who would have done this? Yes, I do have the girls. The girls. I did probably piss off the girls at the lake. Ugh, fuck them. Well, I'll have the rangers keep an eye out for a couple of young women and question any they find. I can't believe someone would do this. I worry about bears and fires, and that's about it. And now I've got to worry about some, what, violent campers? Uh, okay, in the morning I'm going to call my friend Patty, who works the desk down in Cody. They keep a list of everyone who's officially been in and out of the trailhead since, I don't know, forever, and see if we can get a list of names. We won't okay, get much, yes, but at least if anything else happens, we can refer to it and see if anything comes up. Thanks. Great I stuff. need you to feel safe out here. Uh, don't worry. Just tell me where to find a gun. Just point me to the Forest Service weapons cache and I'll feel safer than the Pope in his little car. Yeah, uh, someone made the choice years ago that leaving people with infinite amounts of alone time and a gun was kind of a bad idea. Grenades? I'll see what I can do. <laughs> Grenades? <laughs> oh! We done day one! Okay, so we weren't that far from finishing up with the first day. So maybe we can f we can do them day by day. I'm not sure how this works. So I'm not sure how long a day takes, but maybe we can do day two um, in this episode and then we'll do a day each episode. I think that's I think that's a good idea. Okay. Wake up. I'm up. Hey, wake up. I'm awake. I'm awake. What's your problem? Our problem. Our Sorry, problem. our problem. That storm knocked out the phone line I used to talk to the service, which means we're cut off. I tried radioing out, and that's not working either. Uh, okay. There's, There's no, no backup. backup? The backup is the two-day hike out of here. So, that's a no? It's easier for me to send all the lookouts out to check the status of the wire in their areas. Yours is a good hike away. If you find any portion of it down, I can try to get a hold of a ranger and he'll bring someone in to fix it. Okay, I can do that. Where is it? Remember that cave you hiked through yesterday? Yeah, of course. So, you're gonna want to go back there, go through it, and keep going straight to the north when you come out. Will do. Thanks, Hank. It's Henry. What, you don't like Hank? Yeah, I don't like Hank. But thanks rhymes with Hank. Mm, no, it doesn't. Okay, all right. Well then. Oh, look at that fucking view. Oh, that's so nice. Wait, I want to get a better shot of this. That looks so fucking awesome. I really love that. I'm going to use that background as the background for the thumbnail. Yes, I will. <laughs> Indeed, I will. Now, they said we must go to the cave, and then from there we just head on straight. So let's do that. I just have no fucking idea where the cave is now. Okay, we are entering the cave. Um. Ooh. Scary, scary. A gate to cave. It's locked. We can't talk to anybody. Let's head up a little bit deeper. Ugh. It's so scary. Listen to that wind. That sounds so fucking creepy. And this looks so fucking beautiful though. This really looks so beautiful. Gap in bush. Clear. Oh, okay. Awesome. So we just pushed the, 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 the branches out of the way. Great stuff. Okay, let's just see. Alright. This kind of looks like uh, something that went wrong. Not it? 
I can't support anything, so I guess it's not it. Okay then, we are the cable guy. Let's get to the top. So we really can't reach anyone any other way than these wires? What else do you suggest? Smoke signals? Just seems dangerous. <laughs> well, if they don't hear from me for a few days, they'll send someone out. But I'd rather it not come to that. Well, I put away that node. What's this? It's a board and a load of shit, so I just close it up. But it looks like these wires are yeah broken, because there's a wire hanging over there. Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Really? Awesome. Good find. It's like, I don't know, a mile and a half east of me. You just follow the trail up the hill, you can't miss it. I'll go see what the damage is. Alright, now how the fuck do I get up there? Um. Hey, so... There are beer cans all over the ground up here leading up the hill. That's annoying. Yeah, thing is, there were a bunch down at that campsite yesterday. Coincidence, maybe? I don't think so. Same brand, everything. These fucking kids. So, you see, we're heading back into trouble. So those fucking teens are probably going to be over here. The teens, why do you think they'd, do you be, think up they'd there? be up here? Hell if I know, but they better have stayed away from our communication stuff. These fuckers are gonna try and kill us. They're gonna pull all Freddy Krueger shit on us. They're breaking up all go outgoing lines and then they'll hunt us down one for one. Oh fuck. And they have gotten shit here. Yeah? Go to hell. Oh my fucking soul. Really? Port cut wire. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. Oh, these idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. But that's not true. Everything that comes to mind is... illegal. Mm. Let's hear it. <laughs> oh yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm... I don't know. Um... <sighs> Wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am going to need a raise. <sighs> Don't hold your breath. <laughs> I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Oh, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Okay, well, I can see the beer cans leading, so we're gonna follow beer cans. Woo! This looks kinda fucking scary. You would not catch me doing this any day. Not in a fucking lifetime I would do that. There's no way. Hey, what the fuck's this? There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Sure thing. Let's swipe it. Ah! 
Hey, we got a camera. And we got some rope. Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them, in decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Huh. Wow. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. Why? Who the fuck's Brian Goodman? Was he a ranger or something? Oh, no, no. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad, Ned, three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? No. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. Ah. Oh. Why? Why? Where did they go? I don't know. I never really hit it off with old Ned, and, um... One day, they were just gone. Sucks. Anyway, so it goes. Have uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a Photodome employee. I don't know. I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? Definitely that'll happen. Okay, let's just copy the information here. Looks like this thing is the thing that we need because they. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna take anything out of the supply crate for now because we are sorted. Um, where so, are we? Did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? Yeah, no, I was a I fucking. I myself have chosen to super... never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but <laughs> I know I'm a bit of an outlier. Uh, am I gonna I tell her? Mean I'm gonna that tell her. I, I think mean, it's I care about people tell and I like companionship as much as the next person. I'm actually married. But you're here. Yes, I know I'm here. Everything's fine, just, you know, we're taking some time apart, getting some fresh air. A little change. Yeah. All right, well, we can just leave it at that. What Thanks. the fuck happened here? From this burned section of forest, I have no idea where to go. Their trail is pretty cold at this point. Hmm, you're out by Mule Point. No one would camp out in the fireweed. Well, I want you to stay out there, as a favor to little old me. My pleasure. <sighs> okay, we know these young women are sloppy. They must have left some sort of trail. Fuck, I love this. Look at the smoke. We found the smoke. Again. Over the rocky thingy. We're going down through Rocky Canyon. We're on a hike, and we feel so good. We're on a hike. Man! Holy fuck, this thing looked like a spider or something. Not very nice. But I would really love to have to go to a place like this. It would be so fucking awesome though. Look at the lake! Oh no, I wanna fucking grab a fishing rod and start fishing so badly. Oh man. I just love that. Just love it. You know, if it makes you feel any better, you're a member of a diverse club of lookouts that have come to the thoroughfare after a breakup. There was Vernon, whose wife got put away for running cocaine. What the Becca, fuck? who was widowed after her husband, a jockey, was trampled by his horse. And Sharon, whose boyfriend, had his own boyfriend. Maybe you boned the neighbor. Maybe she boned the neighbor. Maybe you both did. I don't judge. And if you ever want to talk breakups, I'm your gal. Right. We didn't, we didn't break, break up. up. We didn't choose to break up. She got sick. I... I'm sorry, Henry. What is it? We'll get into it. Okay. Well, in the meantime, you are here, and it's beautiful, and escaping isn't always something bad. Yeah, yeah, sure. Definitely, thank you. Thank you for your fucking support. Ma'am. 
No, where the f Okay, there's smoke. Aha! What does she have? Well, what does she have? Well, she's got M. She's got Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's. Like, um, dementia. Whoa. How old was she? Is she? She's alive. She's with her family in Melbourne, Australia. She's 43. Fuck. Yeah. What was it like when you guys found out? Well, pretty crap. Devastating. Especially for her. You can understand. And for you. Anyway, everything she worked for was taken away, and that was it. Yeah. I'm sorry to be such a downer. Don't, don't, don't even. I'm happy to listen. And, you know, we'll try to have some fun this summer. I promise. Yeah, definitely. Well, it's for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. Yeah, I think that's where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? Oh, I didn't. I didn't. Yeah, they share their water as a colony that can live for hundreds of years, even through fire. Can you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of these amazing things? Also, uh, by what it looks like on this map, you'll be coming up on a stream that should lead you towards where we saw that smoke. Great stuff, thank you. Wow, this is fucking beautiful, though. Just look at that shit. Look at the sun glaze coming from through the trees. Holy crap, that's beautiful. Uh, now they said we'll find a stream which will lead us to the smoke. How must we go up the stream, or where do we go now? Guess we'll probably go up the stream. It's a really nice waterfall down here. Given those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. Yes. I wonder what the fucking cloth is for. Site and it looks like they've got a fire. Is it them? Oh, it seems like it. I swear, they must have dragged four cases of beer out here. Track them down and don't let them see you. What a job this is. Ah, found my sheets! So they did break into your tower. Looks like. These girls have a full case of beer left here. A full case. Well, they're impressive little shits, I guess. That is some dedication. Their tent looks like it's been through the shredder, which would explain that scrap I found. What could have done that? Like a like a bear or um I don't know, it sounds crazy, but even a bull elk if it's off its rocker. Whatever did it did not hold back. Yes. You've got that camera, right? You no, know, maybe I should take one of their sleeping bags as payback. At this stage, take whatever you want. Yes, definitely. So let's take a picture. Yeah, we took a picture of the campsite. Sleeping bag. Can I take the pocket sleeping bag? Uh, some of their clothes are all torn up. Uh, that's not good. Well, I was gonna come scare these fuckers and now they're in trouble. I have entered the teen zone. Oh, really? And where's that? It's the name of a magazine for girls. It's on the ground here, at their camp. Well, I found some dangerous hunks. What on <laughs> earth are you- It's another one of those magazines. Well, okay. So what the fuck now? I wanted to come scare them, and now I can't fucking scare them. 
Let's just stomp out the fire. Is the fire dead now? Okay, I guess the fire is dead. We stomped out the fire. Now, where the fuck we go now? about this game is the fact that it actually kind of leaves you to do your own exploring it doesn't tell you go go here do this it, it, it almost tells you that but not really hey what's to the south of here um mexico is this some sort of riddle <laughs> i just have a nice view to the south you know trees and mountains forever well, eventually you wander into the area overseen by Chimney Rock Lookout, but that's probably an impossible hike in terms of terrain. Yes, but what I love about this is the fact that, like for instance, they said I must find the campus now. They could be any fucking way, but I'm supposed to go out and literally go look for them. How'd you meet? Well, are you still going to be talking to me? We met in a bar. Met in a bar. Mm, the birthplace of modern romance. <laughs> I stumbled over and told her she was pretty, and that was it. Aw, you were brave. I was drunk. Yes, I was drunk. The fuck? Don't question my methods, woman. Alright, you guys, I've been wandering around very long now. I can't seem to find these teens, and I don't know where if I'm gonna be walking around too much so I think I'm gonna leave this one here luckily we've made some progress we've gotten to some new places and, and we've seen some of the beautiful vistas we've found waterfalls and then we found the smoke and we found the camp again we at least know the teens are gonna get into trouble now so all that so hopefully you guys enjoyed this but I think I'm gonna leave this one here then but for now thank you guys so very much for watching this video if you liked it pound that like button leave me some comments down below and i'll see all you awesome friends in the next video so stay awesome <laughs>